Yo, it's me, Dead Carpet, and this is Dead Carpet Energy Drink Reviews, and it's 4.54 p.m., and it's Wednesday, um, March 4th, 2020. About a week ago, well, actually a week and a half ago now, I went to Tulsa, and I went to the new Winco Foods grocery store in Tulsa, you know? It was, like, really busy, because, like, right after they opened that grocery store, you know? So there was a lot of people there, so I had a hard time, like, finding a parking place, you know? But, um, I got their store brand energy drink. It was really cheap as only 88 cents a can, with the taxes like around, I think, 96 cents per can, so you know, less than a dollar each. So, you know, it was a really good deal. But anyway, today I'm going to be reviewing the original Green Dragon Energy Drink. Aw, oh, yeah, boys. Aw, oh, yeah. 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 Has a silver top with a silver tab. The bomb's a production code. So, you know. Okay. Green Dragon Energy Drink. Caffeine Taurine. 8.4 fluid ounces. 250 milliliters. It shows a green dragon. And it has a red tongue. He's like shooting fire out of his mouth. So, you know. Green Dragon Energy Drink. Please recycle. It has the ball logo. Some other code in the SKU. Warning Carbonated Energy Drink. High caffeine content. This part has 49 milligrams caffeine. <laughs> High caffeine. It has only 49 milligrams caffeine per container. So, you know, so, less than 50 milligrams in this can, so this will get you, like, barely lit. Um, anyway, consuming too much caffeine can be dangerous, cause sleeplessness, anxiety, irritability, rapid heartbeat, breathlessness, and other health issues. Not recommended for children, pregnant, or nursing women, people with heart conditions, or people sensitive to caffeine or niacin, consume moderately. Manufactured for Unique Beverage Company, LLC Everett, Washington, 98213. I think the Unique Beverage Company is the same company that made the, um, um, that one CBD energy drink I recently reviewed, so you know. Nutrition facts, one serving per container, serving size 8.4 fluid ounces, 250 milliliters, amount per serving calories 110. Well, I thought this was like their store brand, but I guess it might not be their store brand, because it says made by the Unique Beverage Company, they made that one purple, like, CBD energy drink that I reviewed, so you know, so that's interesting. Amount per serving, calories 110, total fat 0 grams, 0 percent, sodium 20 milligrams, 1 percent. Total carbohydrates 27 grams, 10 percent, total sugars 27 grams, foods 27 grams, added sugars 54 percent, protein 0 grams, potassium 280 milligrams, 6 percent, niacin 21 milligrams, 130 percent, vitamin B6, 5 milligrams, 300 percent, vitamin B12, 5 micrograms, 200 percent, pentothenic acid 3 milligrams, 60 percent. Has other ingredients in each serving, taurine 7 milligrams, caffeine 49 milligrams, no stall 51 milligrams, so yeah. So that's pretty much the whole can, so I'll let you see it right quick. Not too much to show, you know, or to read off. It's like reflective. Probably gonna be a little bit hard to see, you know. But anyway, yeah. After this one, I'm gonna be reviewing the sugar-free one. And then I have the extreme caffeine one. Let's see, you know, that one's gonna be interesting. These are all probably going to be like Red Bull or Rockstar clones, though. Just saying. Because, you know, it was cheap, you know. It's like their original kind, you know. So, you know, it's not really original, you know. Just saying. Okay. Yeah, you're probably going to be able to see this text good. Here's nutrition facts. You might can see the text okay if you pause it, you know, just saying. Okay, that's pretty much the whole can. So I'm going to shake it up right quick, open it, taste it, and give my review for it. So hold on a minute. Okay, I opened it. The color's like a greenish-yellow color, so it's definitely like a green dragon color, I guess. So you know what I mean? It's bubbling and stuff. But anyway, the smell... <sighs> yeah. Definitely a little bit like a um, Rockstar clone or a Red Bull clone. 
think it smells closer to um, Red Bull than Rockstar, but you know what I mean? Still a little bit the same, you know, like a citrusy type of smell. Definitely very citrusy. Has a pretty good scent, but um, not really original, you know, just saying. Not really unique either, you know, just saying. But yeah, even though, you know, but anyway, smells, you know, pretty much like a Rockstar Red Bull clone, so you know what I mean? I'm going to try it, so here goes. Oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah. Ooh. Yeah, definitely like a Rockstar Red Bull clone. Has a strong carbonation. A little fizzy when it goes down your throat. Probably be a little bit hard to chug this one compared to some of the other drinks I've had. But you know, you probably could though. You know, just saying. Yeah, it was cheap. It was only 88 cents at the Winco Foods grocery store. Has a cool can design. Not too much on the can, though. Pretty basic design a little bit, you know. But, you know, it still looks cool. Um, Flavor-wise, it's definitely like a Red Bull or a Rockstar clone. Um, you know. Has that original citrus flavor, you know. It's sweet, a little tangy and tart. But, you know... If you had a lot of the original energy drinks, you pretty much know what this tastes like, so you know what I mean? But still okay, but definitely for the price, you know. And energy-wise, it has a lot of B vitamins, but only has 49 milligrams caffeine. So it'll only get you a little lit. It will only get you a little lit, just saying. Won't get you too lit, you know. Um, I'd say energy-wise, per can. Lasts maybe an hour to two hours of energy at the most, so you know, works okay. It's definitely weak compared to other energy drinks, you know. Um, it could have been a little bit stronger energy wise, but it has an okay like flavor, you know. It's definitely good for the price, you know, because it's really cheap. It has an okay can design, you know, not too much on the can, a little bit simplistic design, you know what I mean. Flavor wise, it's good, energy wise, it could have been a little bit stronger and it has a cool can design, but it's cheap, so you know, definitely try it if you want to, you know. Um, definitely try it if you can find it, too, you know. Um, but still, I think it's okay, you know. It's not the best, but, you know, it's actually pretty good. Definitely for the price. I'm going to give the original Green Dragon Energy Drink. I actually like it, you know. I'm going to give it a 9 out of 10. Oh yeah, oh yeah, boys. Oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah. It's pretty lit, you know. Even though it won't get you a little lit, but, you know. Still, I definitely think it's a good deal for the price, you know. Flavor-wise, it's good. It has a cool can design. Could have been a little bit stronger energy-wise, but, you know, it's cheap. So, yeah, definitely try it if you can find it. I give it a 9 out of 10. Oh, yeah, oh, yeah, oh, yeah, oh, yeah, oh, yeah, just saying. Anyway, my next review, I'm going to be reviewing the Sugar-Free Green Dragon Energy Drink. Stay tuned for that review. See you in my upcoming review. See you in more videos. Thanks for watching. See you guys later. Peace out. And bye.